Hey, Virgos. So this is for Virgo Sun for the month of July. Let's get it, Virgos. Coming in with the Ten of Wands in reverse, the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, and the Ten of Pentacles in reverse here, Virgos. You guys could have been dealing with a Scorpio, an Aries, a Capricorn, Aquarius, a Leo, a Taurus, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Let's get it, Virgos. Coming in with the Ten of Wands in reverse to the Wheel card. Whatever it is that you guys are not able to get from your workplace here, Virgos, it's saying that it's not going in your favor, all right? So for that, you guys are going to be thinking about releasing it and letting it go. Uh, some of you guys might be ending a job. So your journey is going to be over when it comes to the position of your job. And you're going to be moving on to something else here, Virgos, all right? This job's not able to compensate you what it is that you guys are looking for. You guys are continuing to give freely at your workplace, but you're not being compensated what you have, what you deserve, what you earn, all right, Virgos? Also, it's either some of you guys might be getting terminated or you guys are going to be quitting your jobs for that matter, all right? Um... Yeah, your boss may end up trying to reach back out to you, trying to see if they can get you to come back here, Virgos, but it doesn't look like you guys are going to be responding back to them because you're not really happy with the way that they treated you. Also, sweethearts, for the ones who are dealing with an Aquarius, a Capricorn, uh, for the ones who are dealing with a job situation here, Virgos, it doesn't do nothing for you guys, but leave you guys very much so overwhelmed, but you guys are going to be speaking your truth with the Nine of Cups in reverse. For the ones who are dealing with an Aquarius, a Capricorn, it's not it's not a fulfilling relationship for you guys, Virgos. This person's going to want to come back in and try to talk to you again, but it looks like you guys are still upset with the way that this person had did you wrong. You're not happy with the way that they treated you. Uh, this person gave you a lot of empty promises, Virgos, and that's why they are the fool in reverse. They are a fool because they try to keep promising you stuff that they couldn't keep up with their promises. Regardless, though, the truth is going to be coming out. Once the truth comes out here, Virgos, Leo energy, Aries, Taurus energy, uh, once the truth comes out, you guys are going to finally be standing in your power and saying, you know what, I'm good. I'm going to go and be the Nine of Pentacles But because regardless, Virgos, you guys are independent. You guys are hustlers. You guys get it done. You guys walk will be walking away with integrity at the same time. It's just not working out anymore for the ones who are dealing with a relationship or a work offer here. It's saying it's drying up. It's time to start a new journey here, Virgos, and you guys are definitely going to be defending yourself with the Seven of Wands energy there. Page of Wands here, Virgos, Nine of Swords. Some of you guys might be getting a new love offer coming in towards you guys, Virgos. You guys might be a little bit stressed out. Also, Virgos, if it's coming to your workplace, it's saying that you guys are going to be hearing good news. <laughs> but it's like a little too late to... A little too late, especially for the ones who ended up quitting their jobs or whatever the case is. Somebody here is working in the government here, Virgos, are right. They're going to have to make a decision on what it is that they're going to end up wanting to do. Uh, but regardless, though, there might be a little bit of sneaky shit going on at the same time. Regardless, though, there is going to be a love offer who's going to be wanting to come towards you. Some of you guys may not be ready for this love offer, so you guys are going to be indecisive with the two of wands and are just trying to reflect and trying to figure out, is this the... Is this the is this what I want at the moment? Do I want to be in a relationship? Do I want to just focus on my work? It's two paths. Two paths. One path is going to be love. The next path is going to be work. What are you guys going to choose? Can you guys balance both out at the exact same time? Also, Virgos, there's going to be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius who's going to want to come back towards you. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn who's going to end up sending you a message. This person was very, very sneaky ass with you. They are coming in with an offer. They're going to tell you that they're really passionate about you here too. Um, <laughs> they do have to come towards you here, Virgos. This person broke your heart very, very badly, Virgos, coming in with the Three of Swords energy, Eight of Cups. You guys had no choice but to walk away from this person, Virgos, because they betrayed you. And they don't even realize how much they actually hurt you, Virgos, because of the fact that you have to walk away without letting them know that they hurt you. That's crazy. They don't even know how badly they hurt you. Regardless of Virgo's Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, who wants to come back and talk to you again. They want a new beginning here with you. They're hoping that they can have start everything all over again. But the thing is, this person hasn't been talking to you for quite some time, coming with the Four of Swords energy. This person might be even at a distance from you, Virgo's. But regardless, though, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, they want to come in and, and explain to you how they feel about you. They want to heal the situation, coming in with the Six of Swords energy, Taurus energy here as well. Maybe this person's a little bit spiritual, traditional for that matter here, Virgos. Uh, at the end of the day, they do keep you very close to their heart, uh, but they do carry a lot of secrets at the same time, and they might be a little bit petty. For the ones who are married uh, at the moment here, Virgos, it's saying that you're not getting along with the person that you're married to, but they do love you very, very much, all right? Six of Cups. There's somebody from your past here, Virgos, a Pisces, a Libra, 
who is very much, much so nostalgic on you as well. Some of you guys are in a marriage who are in separation, going through divorce, Virgos, and you guys have children. You guys are not getting along with your partner. Sorry, you guys are not getting along with your partner at the moment here, Virgos, okay? Because so one of you guys were doing all the work while the other one isn't doing anything at all. But regardless, though, they do love you very much. At the end of the day, your world is going to be shaking up, especially if it comes to any finances or anything like that here, Virgos. But I do know that everything will be okay. Tri uh, trials overcome. You guys are going to have to make a decision, Virgos, when this, when this tower comes in for you guys. Because you're not sure what to do. But at the end of the day, even though you don't know what to do, you actually know what the correct answer is to you not knowing what to do so do know that on the new moon of the month of july you're going to get the you're going to understand what the right decision is going to be so maybe during the night the so maybe during the month of june you guys are suffering and not knowing what decision to make or maybe even at the end of the month of june july you're not going to know what to do but then in the month of August, new moon, you guys are going to get the intuition and realize, okay, well, you know what? I know what to do now, right? Uh, and then the wands here, Virgos, take care of yourselves properly because you guys have been through a whole lot as well. Um, and you guys are going to be a little bit indecisive, but regardless though, somebody here might be going through bankruptcy as well here, Virgos, or whatever the case is. But at the end of the day, make sure you guys take care of your health, take care of your well-being, Take your supplements, drink water here, Virgos. It's very important to do stuff like that. You guys might be a little bit imbalanced at the moment when it comes to your health, but regardless, though, take care of yourselves. Hermit card. All right, Virgos, you guys are very wise. All right, you guys are going to find the clarity that you need when it comes to anybody who is dealing with any some sort of depression here coming with the Five of Cups energy. There is a Virgo who wants to come back in for communication. They're starting to realize that they were the ones that did wrong and they missed it on a huge opportunity with you that could have brought them the most happiness here, Virgo. This person still holds on to you with the Three of Wands energy and they want a renewal coming with the Judgment card and they want to probably most likely be in a relationship but more so a reunion for you guys. This person's going to have to do what they have to do to come back for you, Virgos. Uh, and they and they want to heal the situation with the Three of Cups energy because they know that they stagnated it for way too long. Uh, Queen of Wands energy, this person, Gem, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces energy, who's very selfish for you guys. They're going to want to try and come back in to communicate with you here too, hoping that they can be with you as well. They're going to be taking action, Virgos, and trying to communicate with you with the Page of Cups energy. You guys are very loving and sweet here, Virgos. This Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, a Virgo, a Gemini might be a little bit... Um, might be a little bit selfish. I'm going to try and do whatever they have to do to get you, win you back, whatever the case is. Even if that means they have to spoil you, give you money. They are only going to be about themselves here. Virgo's coming with the chariot card. And it will make you feel a little bit stressed out or trapped. Or that's how they're going to be feeling if they're not going to be knowing that they cannot get you back. Thanks, cuties. Bye.